10. So today we are reviewing Ghost in the Wires by Kevin Mitnick. So wh what did you think of the book? Well it was very good, I really enjoyed it. Yeah it did, it, it had all the great elements that makes a great story. It had... Um, and he used good describing words. He used very good describing words to explain his adventures. It had everything. It had laughter, humour. Oh man, I can't believe it. Huh? It had drama. Oh man, what will happen now? Will he get away from him? Maybe he'll get fired. It had sadness. <laughs> So, all in all, it, it was a great book, really enjoyable, and I strongly recommend you go to Amazon and get an insight into the, the mind of one of the, one of the most infamous hackers that has ever lived. And uh, he's free now, darling, you can put it down. He's never going to be free! Um, maybe so, maybe he'll never be free of his past. Uh, but we can only give him a chance. However, if you're expecting a book in which he would uh, just apologise for the whole 20 chapters, then it's probably not the book for you. If you're just looking only for stories, um, you're probably better get off The Art of Deception. Just stories, no personal life. But if you want to get an insight into his mind, then go to Amazon and buy the book now. Stay secure, my friends. Hold on, that was my line. <laughs>